Okay, Douglas, um, can you tell us just a little bit about uh, how your amazing invention works and what it does? Well, it's a flat pack wind turbine, which uh, means it's modular and it, it goes up in sections without tools. Uh, and so it, it fits in a standard UK pallet, and that means it can be deployed to rural areas, uh, such as refugee shelters and d disaster zones. Okay, and, and how does it work? Does it does it literally just is it just wind power that that, that, that drives it? Yeah, yeah, it just uses wind tur uh, wind power to turn the turbine, and that generates energy, which can be used for other things. Okay, and it could be used. You mentioned refugee uh, centres and the like. Yeah, Any yeah. other areas you could so, think of? So, well, I, I started. Uh, I, I I watched a documentary about the IKEA refugee shelters, which are flat pack, uh, and then I thought maybe I could do this to sort of tie in with it. Uh, and then I also thought there would be other applications like disaster zones and rural areas that struggle to get energy. Okay, and what, what sort of power does it does it come from? It does it gen could it run a radio or what sort of things could it could it run? I, well, it can. Th this this one can uh, charge up a phone. Just wanted. Uh, could you tell me a little bit about why um, Caledonian University has got involved in this amazing project, primary engineer and secondary engineer project? Yeah, I, I guess I, I met Susan Skerlock several years ago and, and was inspired by the idea of getting more young children into engineering and this seemed like a great way to do it. So I've been going out and visiting schools on a regular basis, once or twice a year. There's also the opportunity to live stream to, to schools to get a, a wider coverage as well. So that's a really good way of getting kind of personal contact with the school students to, to understand what engineering is all about from an engineer's perspective. And, and do, you, do you find that there is currently a, a, a problem, an issue with um, recruiting young engineers or are there, are there quite a number uh, you know, signing up to come to university? I, I, I think over the years it, 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 this may be declining slightly but it, it, it depends from year to year on the type of engineering that seems popular at the moment and, and these sorts of things. But in general I think engineering is a really good career and more people could come. We're always short of engineers, generally.